We purchased the Go Sun Fusion and it came today. The cool thing about this is that it has dual power. It can use the sun and it can use electricity. So today we will be testing the electricity part. The reason we'll be testing electricity is because it's not sunny outside. So let me show you what it looks like inside. This is the sun tracker. It helps so you can stick this in the right position. As you can see, it can move in different directions. Also, you want to hold your hand on this while you turn it because you don't want it to spill. So let's say I do this. The only thing with this one is that you cannot move the tube vertical. So now we are going to try and boil 1.5 liters of water using the electricity. There is this heating element underneath here. We have a temperature probe inside here. It is currently 20 Celsius. This is connected to the battery bank. So let's get started. So, gotta turn it on. I really like the fact that they have this switch so you can just keep it plugged in, but if when you want to turn it on, you just have to switch a button. You don't have to like keep plugging it in and out. From our battery bank, it draws 12 volts and close to 11 amps. That's about 130 watts. After 60 minutes, it is 160 Fahrenheit, or 71 Celsius. After 90 minutes, it is 198 Fahrenheit, or 92 Celsius. After 105 minutes, it is 208 Fahrenheit, or 98 Celsius. We eventually got it to boil. It's been about an hour and 45 minutes. That's about 250 watts of energy used. The next episode would be a head-to-head -head competition of the GoSun Fusion and the High Sun. Hope you enjoyed this video on the Go Sun Fusion. Lord, thank you for today. Thank you for touching the people watching and blessing them. Yeshua's name, amen. So until next time, keep smiling.